There's a lot of them. <laughs> um, like delicious. You're supposed to start with Facebook now. I really love about Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, that was last week. Sorry. No, no. Well, Facebook's Google still very much. Google, Google, and Google search and Google Maps. Google Maps. You got the ones that are around. Switch around there. What? You can switch rooms. Yeah, we did switch rooms because we needed a whiteboard. So we put whoever was in here into the cream. Okay. Google, Google search. Um, oh yeah, the search sheet, that's right. Just the generalized Google API. Yeah. Um, which is actually cool, I've done something with that one. Um, uh, got Amazon and eBay and like Google is doing something for a long time. Amazon, like which one specifically for Amazon? I don't know any of them. They've got the, the, the e commerce thing and it's very Well, it's not really a massive. Yeah. E commerce is basically you can get it in the Amazon catalog ECS. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, Flickr. Available for Yeah, Flickr. Local Seattle. Thanks. Um, that's not nice. Yeah. Um, does they have any yeah. I don't know what it offers. They have a ton of stuff that came out with them. Oh, yeah, that's there. They have all that stuff. Um, you do have a series. Yeah. Oh, okay. You've got the whole RSS cloud. I mean, that's a yeah. Graphsity, um, things get, once you do the Seattle ones, things in Seattle companies with them. I was like, Graphsity's good, there's a uh, binary, uh, blue dot. Uh, is that fine? Is that ORY? Yeah, binary. binary. Personalized news. Would you consider this basically all RSS feeds as sort of being, because we are. Hell yeah, because I they're I mean, they're sources. Yeah, that's uh, sources. So it's, it's really it's really easy to. Is Seattle Library anything? Is what? Is Seattle Library? Yeah, yeah. 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 So there's also <laughs> well, Yahoo has their sort of yeah. Well, yeah, they have, well, they have the, their pipes, they have the pipes, pipes, and which is Jersey. Yes, the Yahoo is the Yahoo. Yeah. Nice yeah. Microsoft pop or something. Yeah. Oh, I can't get into the baby for that. So I haven't tried it. I'll send you an invite. I'd also put the Yahoo um, widgets as well. You have to put the microphones. It's fun. So if, if, if you guys want, like, a, we, we, we can, what we've done before is we've actually just hooked up a few of these and say we'll work on this later, um, like later being like tomorrow and over the next week, because we don't want to have a time in an hour to get one done. Um, so email me and I will uh, build up a, you know, like a mailing list of put everybody into is, is what I need to build a mailing list. And then uh, get it, get actually the development done. Well, when it's all done, we can email the find camp mailing list. Um, so what other APIs do we have? I'll plug my own company, Zilla has one. Do <laughs> <laughs> you guys have any more plugging? Zilla has one. All you need to know is one. What about the Brian Starbucks uh, resume site? Oh, do they have one? I don't remember, Talent Spring, I don't know. Yeah, I would love to play with that. Like they might. Talent Spring is cool, I'm totally down with that idea. Um, Uh, yeah, we'll put it down. Oh my god, we'll um, uh, What else? Oh, widgets. We have the widgets. Um, Pro presence APIs. 
API out there. Like, what? Uh, places. Presence API out yeah, like places or like even um, instant messaging like they also have three odd messenger. Oh yeah. Messenger. Those ones are good because those are always like, you know, Twitter does that so you can, you know, Twitter through whatever you want. Twitter, um, messenger presence. Seems like, like, like whether people are online or not. Is that like at Nico or? Sure, yeah. Is there any music related? Um, we got Rhapsody on here. Um, but I don't know what else. Like music recommendations. Well, that's what I'm saying. There's um, the radio one. Last FM. Last FM. Yeah. We'll see if they remain to be cool after they've been bought by CBS. Upcoming. Oh, upcoming. Yeah. I think Outside In has local news mm -hmm. from an API now. Does the Reuters have something they're doing now? I don't know, maybe. I know they've got a ton of RSS. Yeah, so, yes, yeah, news. <laughs> news. <laughs> That's part of, I mean, just through RSS, you can get as much news as you want. Um, Check who? Okay, I'll um, just do that right next to Twitter. Um, so I guess, do we have, so we got a lot of like, uh, I don't know, it'd be cool to, now you got to kind of think of start ways to connect things together. Um, so like, before we've used Rhapsody and Google Calendars, um, to build a basically a JavaScript alarm clock, where you can give it your you can set up events on your Google Calendar to start playing a Rhapsody event. Um, so what else? What else do you guys? I mean, like, what are ways you think you interesting ways? Do you think you can connect stuff? I mean, just choose two random ones. We'll see how we can connect. <laughs> okay, so let's just, just close your eyes and point. <laughs> no, because now I know I wrote them on there. I know where they are now. Three. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think I think three is more interesting actually. Okay. Sure. Because just just because I never done three. Yeah, I two. <laughs> well, I well I personally am part of Flickr. Almost usually takes three, doesn't it? Yeah. So Flickr with. Uh, what about Flickr and Google Maps? Well, that's yeah. geotech. Yeah. Yeah. That, that, that. Or Twitter with Google Maps to. Uh, and Flickr. Twitter, Twitter, Flickr, and, and the maps, so you can see where people are. And what they're doing at the moment. Yeah. Well, you could, you could, or throw up, throw up coming with Flickr, so for more of like the event-based uh, photo feeds. Yeah, that'd be cool if you could automatically tie like the tag from from upcoming to the Flickr, and then it like it would show. That's kind of cool. Pictures from last night's concert. Yeah, well, yeah. So you could yeah. people that have the same tag in Flickr, well, you can use it, and so you can link them by, by that. That's kind of cool. Google Maps, yeah, and then we'll, yeah, you can toss the maps in there for the hell of it. Maps goes into everything. Yeah, maps yeah. go. Yeah, basically, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, well, not everything, but but you can basically you can, yeah, you can you can figure it out in some possible way. <laughs> Believe me, I've tried, and it works. <laughs> um, and then I guess along with upcoming, like for especially with bands, you can tie it to you got Amazon. Amazon's kind of the same way. You can figure out related yeah. stuff. With it. And, well, and last.fm does have a, an idea. Uh, How about upcoming with Google Maps and Flickr to show pictures of previous events just like the one that's coming? Yeah, like Mind Camps. Sure. Yeah, so you can see previous Mind Camps ones. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have like a, or upcoming with Flickr. Flickr. Yeah. Okay. And we can even throw a Twitter and stuff like during an event like right now. If, if that finds a flicker a new flicker image for the tag it can throw it out to a twitter id that people can see yeah. oh yeah so it just it it pumps out it pumps out twitters yeah or tw tweets or whatever yeah. the hell they're called <laughs> maybe, yeah. maybe pivot that on the uh, i'm trying to find what to do on saturday so upcoming is giving me that pictures of the previous events and location as well yeah so search, basically search like play like a grease monkey thing for for everyone on upcoming.org mm -hmm. it would say you know, just inject something and it says, here's pictures from the last time something like this happened. Mm -hmm. Or basically, does upcoming do concerts or is upcoming? Everything. Everything. 
So there was a concert. You could just say the last concert. Well, yeah. Hey, so yeah. Not necessarily that. So and also like the last, the previous mind camp, or yeah. you know, the last whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are there any um, APIs that sort of link up people with interests? So uh, if you can see that, uh, you know, Facebook. Yeah. Uh, Forty three things. Uh, Forty three things. So if you if you, you can see if there there are some people whose opinion you uh, you you know or you, know, you, you like it a lot or something like that you might say oh what are they doing and you find them if it's upcoming or something yeah I don't know I like I like the idea of of I don't know, upcoming dot org I guess already does it but it's finding similar events it already does that automatically. Okay. Um, but there's there's more along the lines of, I mean, I, I mean, I was, we obviously should be thinking about Facebook, of course, because it's totally badass. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Mr. Loving here can tell you that. Um, um, more content discovery things, though, like yeah, if someone you know tweets that they're listening to a certain song. Um, you have an application that. Can, Take that song into a clip. Has anybody made an iTunes plugin yet that said that I make the updates your Twitters with, with every no. song you're listening to? That's a good idea. Really? Well, I can't really believe it. Well, YouTube, you know, any of these I things. I like that's a little bit of yeah. um, That's like the big thing that was discovering yeah. similar content. Well, you, you, also, it, you want to discover content that's going to be cool before it's cool, so you can be like, I saw that last week. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're like, oh, you're sending me the monkey smile on its finger now? Falling off the tree, anybody remember that one? <laughs> um, Has anyone done a Twitter, Facebook app where it just shows? Yeah, uh, it's it's me, yeah. 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 Hey, they're all really simple though. Like, I don't know. Oh, that's Seems like a lot of the Facebook okay. apps <laughs> don't work how you would want them to work. You know, they're not. Well, they've got high. It's, it's a high school user base now. Yeah. So it's hard for it's hard for us adults. It's, 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 as much as it pains me to call myself that. To kind of to understand exactly the high school mentality still, because mm -hmm. whoa, it's so awesome. I know because the but like the number three on on there is like the food fight, <laughs> which makes no sense. <laughs> um, Those are college age students that are doing that. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny because my boss is like throwing bananas at me at work, um, and he's forty something. I, but I didn't say that. He's not that old. Um, <laughs> Ouch! We have video. How much yeah, that work for you? We're getting this one day. Um, so content discovery is a good way to kind of like want to sit, stick around on. Um, I don't know. Like it. I also think Talent Spring is really cool because that's not something. If they actually have an API, where's this Brian? He's not here. Because that'd be cool. If they do they have an RSS feed at least. What is it? The one that like you do you, you oh, choose right, resumes right. which one's better and the best ones float to the top. But are an RSS feed of the resumes? Or yeah, or something. I think they're closed off this person. Yeah. Oh, lame. But we don't we don't pay, off. we're not paying for anything. <laughs> <laughs> free mashups, you the name. Free mashups. Yeah, free mashups. Alright. Um you can sort of mix up dig with Google Maps to both of the places seeing them on the map, uh, kind of like restaurant reviews. Yep, yep, that's what Oh, so yeah, Yelp, Yelp. pulling Yelp out. Is Yelp, Yelp is not an API. I don't think so. I've tried. They yeah. don't? Oh. No, they're not very excited to do one. Yeah, Are you a red screen scraper? I mean, you can make your own Yeah, I'm not going to write a screen scraper, though, at that. Because we also want to be able to input it. You know, we want to be able to put back in the screen scraper. There's some, there's, there's a webpage that you They will. Do they? Uh, yeah. They will do one. Yeah. They will? Mm -hmm. How about upcoming it's events? Some really good yeah. Yeah. LinkedIn is nice to Facebook. Because they're responding to Facebook's platform. Yeah, LinkedIn platform. is going to do the same thing. Oh, so you can, well, yeah, you can always do that with Delicious. You can find like your most popular tags in Delicious. And kind of find, and then wrap, wrap it into upcoming, find things that are tagged with your most popular ones in upcoming in Seattle. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Because that would, I feel like upcoming is not, it's not so big that you can't, because I basically read every upcoming thing for Seattle. So that's not, I don't find, you know, that's to be particularly useful. Well, what if you do that and you add, you know, 
whatever. This is my session, so I want to do this my yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you add add the other event sites. You add the you add, you know the Seattle Times, and you add Eventbrite, and you add you know yeah. a bunch of them together. Yeah, that's, that's how this works. Yeah, the I can conglomerate it all together. Yeah, like that. So just the coming plus uh -huh. other. But the ultimate spam tool, as it from a publishing perspective, like I just blog something. And you could get it on all of these. Oh, yeah, well, it's, oh yeah, you want to? You want to republish that blog on like Twitter, right? Well, that'd be cool. Yeah, there's stuff like that. But yeah, that'd be cool. Like you, you blog something that it post, the post like you tweet it to. Twitter, 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 delicious. It, be, it screams RSS feeds and reposts to yeah. that have an API. So um, there are of course posting APIs on WordPress and stuff. Yeah, there's a WordPress oh, yeah. Is there an API for Regen Culture? Yeah, that's all they are. Who? Uh, it's pure API. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah. like, like you yeah. 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 People are actually using Mechanical Turk to uh, get around captchas. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Nice. Yeah. I'll, put, I'll put mine up. My awesome. favorite one would be Mechanical yeah. Turk mashed up with. Uh, with the no password, what is that called? Capture. No bug? Bug me now. 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 Yeah. So yeah. anyone can contribute on a site, type in $5, and we may generate 100 New York Times logins just on your $5, you just give them a PayPal. Basically, <laughs> sure a request for New York Times. He wants to create uh, hundreds of New York Times logins. Yeah. Basically, spam them. Spam their logins. It's not for New York Times anywhere. Where it bugs you? Whenever you're bug me nodding, you say, yeah. And it doesn't work. So a list of it would automatically like update who yeah. doesn't have logins yet for Bug Me Not. Just that work. Bug Me Not won't give you a New York Times one anymore because it's a paid service. Oh. It's, not even, it's not even available anymore. Oh. Unfortunately, I tried to get one the other day. Oh. It's like, yeah, I'm sorry, that's a paid site. We won't give you any. Like, oh, the Bug Me Not. Bug Me Not. What legit is that? No, I put in NewYorkTimes.com. They're like, oh, sorry, it's a paid site. We're not going to give you any. Oh, oh. sure. Yeah. Sure, New York Times. Well, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Probably. Okay. There's clever little things you can do with Enter, like, I don't know, create a service for virtual shoppers for people who will be monitoring eBay for the thing that's not there but frequently comes up once a month or something. Mm -hmm. That was so complicated, I don't think I even understand yeah. it. <laughs> I, well, my problem is I'm not exactly sure what Mechanical Turk has. Yeah, does. It's artificial, artificial intelligence. See, something like that doesn't explain it to me. What it, happens, <laughs> see, what what it, it does is, is it gives a, is a human task to a human person, a tiny thing for them to do, and then they do it. Yeah. And then, it's, and then it goes back out into your program. Yeah. So how do? So who's who's doing the people who sign up? I want to do human yeah. stuff, and they're like, I'll answer that question. Or I'll type. Do they get paid for it? Yeah. In, in yeah. Amazon, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. There's like, there was, there was a search party. Yeah. People were looking for uh, people overboard. Yeah. They were looking for a boat that had capsized. Okay. And they basically fed <laughs> millions of satellite images in to Mechanical Turk, and people were like, Yeah, I don't know if that's a boat or not, but it might be. And it like flagged it for somebody else that knew what they were looking for to like take a deeper look. So they're okay. scanning okay. a picture. Yeah. I get it now. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Transcribe a podcast. Yeah, exactly. there's, a lot of that. Tags, tag, there's, there's a there's a there's a transcription service that <laughs> oh, okay. Draw yeah. lines on the streets. They use them. Yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, is that a, the Seattle one? Uh huh. I'm those games. No, I'm, I'm thinking no. Uh, the the podcast Trans one. No, not not those games. Okay. Uh, plug. 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 Yeah. Not plug. Not plug. Plug is better. It's different. Plug is not. Okay. Um. So. Okay, so we've had upcoming with Flickr to get last pictures. There are pictures from like the last thing or similar things. Um, and then also, what else along with that? So I guess we need to, I, I need to start writing these out, actually down. I guess you say we. I need to start writing these down. Um, here, uh, right. we'll have to remember these ones. Okay. Facebook to see who's going to it. Everybody? <laughs> well, no, no, no. I mean, no, just you can your friends. Event from yeah. Oh, yeah. I got a, a, an upcoming that art. Like, that's a cool event. That's, yeah. That's, you can see who's got, who's got tickets. Well, you, who's going. No, you can see. Yeah, who's got tickets is actually, that's huge. Because, like, you know, like, uh, things sell out in no time at all. So if you have a ticket, you can be like, I have a ticket on Facebook. You can, you can automatically pull the information in over from upcoming. Well, I mean, if, if you take even the, the high school and college mentality user group and Facebook, I remember when I was in, in college, getting a ride home, <laughs> you know, yeah, from, from, sure. from yeah. spring, you know, spring break. So what if upcoming is, you know, Thanksgiving? 
Thanksgiving break, and Just, I need to go right here. You connect up with Facebook. Who is going from the Greater Boston area to Hartford? Last week. What? Yeah, they have a car oh, there is one. Yeah, awesome. really good. That yeah. sounds awesome. Yeah. yeah. I got a little excited there for a second. I was like, that one sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna make that one make money on this. You had a black hat idea, Chris, to uh, organize your own uh, dig mafia using MTurk. Oh! Dig mafia. What's MTurk? Mechanical. Oh, that's actually that's that's dangerous. Oh my god! We can go from Zeus brother to the This is like that's like a money. Like big companies would pay that for that service. The problem is that all those accounts have never dug anything before and they, you know, while they're not... That's not, that's real hard to be tracked. No, I think the accounts are What's another one before we generate the spam? Yeah. Um, what were some of the other ones that we talked about? Well, where's somebody from Zillow? Where's the guy that says what, what's one you want to see with Zillow? Because I mean, you guys have cool data. Um, who's got an extra bedroom? You know, who's got an extra bedroom? These are five bedroom houses. Yeah. House swapping, like you know, vacation house swapping. That would be a good one. Mm -hmm. What is what do you what can you what data can you get from the Zillow API? Uh, property details, uh, like nuts and nuts, beds, baths, square you, footage. What do you give it? An address. Yeah. What about Doppler? Does it have any APIs? I don't know what Doppler is. It's a tra travel thing. Today. I'm looking here. I'm traveling there. But like the house swapping stuff, that might be interesting in a Doppler community. Ooh. Yeah. House swap. I'm, I'm going on a month vacation. Who wants to stay stay in my house so I don't have to write a college student to do it? They do that. I mean, I don't know. Wasn't, there, wasn't there just a movie about this? Oh, yeah. A really bad yeah. romantic comedy that I didn't see? <laughs> <laughs> I'm married. I don't have to be forced to go to this anymore. <laughs> well, there are services. There are clubs now you can do this, right? You yeah. You pay into a club and then you basically are doing the house swap for free, but you've sort of got this pseudo trusted community that's doing it together. Who well, is that couch surfer? Yeah. Couch surfer. Yeah, but it's your houses. Yeah. So my parents. Yeah. Are there's. You're, you're not going to couch surf? What? Your parents aren't going to couch surf? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, yeah, and I mean, even on, of course, with House Swap, there's the Google Maps. So Google Maps and Zillow. And the photo says okay. upcoming, like, if you could think about cities you wouldn't normally think of, if you see there's a concert and some photos Activities, from yeah. near that house, then you might or a house to I'm swap. going to San Antonio. Yeah. And you never would have thought yeah. of that. If there's a house to swap somewhere and you match yeah. it up, Oh, there's someone has a, my house is available. Swap. Let's talk, and then someone. And the list of events going on at the time. Yeah, swapping. seriously. Yeah. 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 That's not that's not I wouldn't go to Texas normally, but yeah, no, let's go no, see no. Houston. Let's see what's let's going on. Let's go to fish. Well, you can also dip into. And then your your you're previously attended. Yeah, if you agree, events, it would automatically yeah. give you see what's going on in the city. You flight want to go to. costs for both parties. Fair casting. Fair casting. Is that right? Except that you don't have to. The house has to be available. You don't have to swap. You and I don't have to swap. Yeah, we don't have to swap, but it's... You might want my house, and I want his house. And he wants yeah. your house. It's so it's just... On, right? right. It's just housing yeah. in general. Right. Kayak has an API. There you go. Oh, from, you, can, you can search for flights between any two cities. Really? Yeah. Oh, so that's freaking sweet. Who, which one was that? Kayak. Hmm? Kayak. Kayak. Three of you. Yeah. It's pretty cool. And they're not free. What's that? They're not free. Competitor pay. We steal it better. No. Kayak, I mean, that's, searching for flights not really their business model of kayak, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah like, it's, it's booking, thought booking and watching the fare rates go so you find an ultimate time. Yeah. That was their big. So I think, I think, kayak is just like, they just have a really sweet UI. Yeah. 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 This whole housing and events, like it kind of, oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, like, you know, I'm thinking, like if I want to go down for um, for uh, spring training, then I can be like, 
I'm gonna be I wanna be in Mesa on these days and there's a lot of people that want to do that. Just kidding. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> no, this is very cool. You can add yes. to that too. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. this is really cool. Yes. Especially if both parties can see how much the flights are, you know, before they agree to swap houses. You don't even have to do the, the entire swapping thing. You can simply create a travel based thing that uh, I want to travel to Seattle. I'm going to be there for a couple of days. What are the things that are happening? What are the pictures? What are uh, folks suggesting locally? Pull in. Or, or I want to go to that page. Hey, show, me, show me who's got a house swap available. Sure. Yeah. Hey, if you're house swapping, also the thing, show the local grocery store. New neighborhood. What do you wear to go buy a child? Oh, yeah. <laughs> just have that in there. Where's the grocery store? Is there anywhere to go? Where's. Yeah, so just, yeah. just basically you're going to this kind of the person yeah. after they get to the house. Well, that's that's kind of of, uh, yes. Uh, uh, food food so that would be that uh, uh, yes. for mm -hmm. restaurants. I think they're doing like shopping. No, Yelp has grocery stores. I know, but yeah. I mean, I mean, they don't have the APA. Like, uh, but you're still scared. It was weird when I saw a review from my local Safeway. I was like, Safeway. I'm going to do some stuff on there because it's like. <laughs> um, okay. Maybe not even a, maybe an and opposite well, mafia. Like, well, like, well, like, we gotta add that. This is all going to be, um, there'll be a Facebook component to this too, without we'll a Facebook module. Did you, are you, did you say you had a crime post? Is that, is that up and running yet? A what? Crime, we had, we're talking about crime posts. Oh yeah, poster crime. Or poster, poster crime? Poster crime dot com. That and Zillow would be a good map, mashup. Can you spell that? Post a crime. It's, so I mean, it's, it, this whole this whole business is based on the map. Oh, okay. Uh, so yeah, it's, yeah. Most of the I'm not gonna do it. I just want to plug the Maybe you did your dig mafia backwards. So like, their job is to dig stuff, but to bury stuff. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Do they put downs, you know. <laughs> you both service. get down on both parties. <laughs> 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 Was armed versus in the eighties. Worked at. We used to have the Lord of War. <laughs> armed both sides. So what are we building with? Like? <laughs> this, this, what's? I mean, this is for like I'll, I'll, I'll help organize getting the build teams together. Um, because that's I think these are cool. I love mashups. I built several of them. Um. Just so you know, this maybe it's gonna all be done in JavaScript, which is pretty sweet. <laughs> Parsing an RSS feed in JavaScript is really cool. <laughs> it's amazingly easy. Um, just FYI. Um, I like this one too. Who's going to something? This actually has some like value, I think, as well. So does this one. This one is just evil. Um, so what else? Anybody? I mean, news is cool. Um, upcoming is tagged. So if you could use the tags off of upcoming to find Flickr news, or Finder news, which would be interesting. Um, I was thinking you could build, this would be on the dig market style. Uh, with all of these different things, you, somebody, any one of us, could put together a really sweet SEO site where you just put out tons and tons of pages with lots of custom information. And you know, you sell ads on those pages and you show up for weird searches. You know, you just go for the long, long tail. Like have you ever seen Zoom info? Mm -hmm. I've been seeing Zoom info a lot. You type in random na people's names. Mm -hmm. Any professional in the world is on yeah. Zoom info. Mm -hmm. It'd be like a service for domainers, right? Could you yeah. could you use Mechanical Turk to try to out <laughs> Mahalo? Jason Calcanis, like, <laughs> <laughs> see, because he's like offering to pay like ten bucks per huge search end result page. And, like, if you, if you, I mean, to do with the Google API, have Turks curate Google results. Exactly, just start going for it. Wouldn't be maybe wouldn't be as good as Mahalo is supposed to be, but you could just swamp them with lots of it. great pages of hey. of human cur you know, curated. Content. I don't know. That sounds kind of high and hard. <laughs> I mean, like, not, like, not like high, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, that sounds like actual work. A weekend. <laughs> That's highfalutin, I should have said that. <laughs> um, all right. 
Not that it's a bad idea. Sorry, we're not supposed to reject ideas. Has anyone matched anything up with like real physical devices? Like, I don't know, like if you got Twitter things showing up to like, or like, I don't know, like a small like actual, I'm just, I don't know. There's something like, shows up on the Yeah. <laughs> like like Twitter. Or like, <laughs> if, like, like, if it has like, like, like a special code, code like, 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 Twitter would generate a postcard. The guy who did, who did uh, <laughs> SMS uh, with a, he rigged a bicycle to spray chalk on the sidewalk. Oh, so, he got arrested. Is that the guy who just put bikes against bushes in yeah. the air? Yeah, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah. And then he got arrested. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that was fun while it lasted. For chalk? Oh, mostly for political messages during the Republican National Convention. Oh. <laughs> but that's still a cool idea. It's pretty cool. Um, yeah, physical devices are always fun. Like a brake light or something? Like you could turn it on with like a You could put up some yeah. bridges. Yeah. So we're, we're not raising our hands, so you don't have to wait. Oh, I don't want to, I don't want to just yell. But what I'm wondering, is there a way you could match up? Let's say an organization wanted to, um, they, they, they wanted to do a, let's say it's a nonprofit, and they're looking for a caterer in some space. And they want to see what's, what's open for, they have a date, so they want to see all the different places that are open and, you know, prices. Is there anything already that you could up there that could handle something like that? I'm trying to think of where you can grab the data from. Maybe if OpenTable had something, we're, uh, that's a great idea. You could have some space stuff like rendered like out of one that. that if you, yeah, actually, that is a good idea. Good idea. If you, but if you built a database of certain people and email addresses, yeah. and you could then, like, put out a query, like, maybe by email well, we asking for a response are you available this well day? even even and Google, then they would Google Maps and business you. interact so if all the places that have space were on them yeah but in, and calendars so that's what you'd need you'd need the calendars to interact I talked to a like about upcoming that. that's a good one you can do it. So you just anytime you have that problem in anyone's room, anytime you have that, if you could just build this big list of all these things that are on the internet on these various random websites, Mechanical Turk. That's yeah. that really is your answer. Okay. Like, <laughs> just put out you know, city by city, find me at every. What is that? Do you know what that randomly costs? Like, I did an exercise in it. Just to, I've done three, and it, it's. You don't want to do it. It's not worth your time. It's like two cents, five cents. No. For how much? For did a ten minute. Basically, no, 10 minutes of work, you pay about five cents for it. Well, you're kidding. But you specify the price, right? So depending yeah. on how, yeah. how valuable the work is, yeah. you determine how much. Yeah, but I was drawing lines on British roads to show like where the edge of the sidewalk is. Well, Just, it is kind of a brilliant yeah, yeah. problem that, you know, so that they basically have the exact road width from averaging two or three people's drawings over on these all these pictures. Hmm. Uh, it's painful. It was. <laughs> so, like, Seven minutes. Just I just wanted to go through it and actually feel what it was like to be a person doing it, and I think I got ten cents for it or five cents. But how much would it cost? Oh no, I mean the other way. Yeah. How much would it cost? That's not exactly the question. You it's only ten percent more than that. Exactly. So my answer is ten percent more than what I was paid. So yeah. but six cents. Is that each idea? Per query. And uh -huh. you, you build out how much how you want if you want to replicate three times, and it's fifteen percent cents per yeah. query. But like when you, you have a MTurk task, for example, to collect a list of information, how do you manage so that if someone gives you option A, no one goes and relists A again? You, like there is a way where, you know what I mean? Like well, I need a yeah. list of the sites that does that. And you don't want everyone giving you uh, Google.com or Microsoft.com because you already had that. You know, how, how do you manage that? I think the trick is to break it down. I mean, there are a few different ways you approach that. You break it down by geographic areas. So you're like, yeah. just in this neighborhood, just in this neighborhood, just yeah, in this but neighborhood. Or you say, not on this list, on another site. And you send them to another site, and you're like, if you find a place that's not on this list, five cents for you. And you're, you're uh, so you have to, to, to build, build the infrastructure manually in this case. Um, that keeps the list populated as per yeah. people, you know, adding more stuff to you. And then we'll probably be looking up in that list and validating if yeah. it's there or not. In fact, there was one, it was like a Dungeons and Dragons, no, it was World of Warcraft. That was one I was looking at the same day. World of Warcraft, add a guild name that hasn't been on this list before, or I don't know, something. <laughs> hmm. Oh my god, that means somebody was charging for guild names. Like, we'll name your guild. <laughs> no, it's questions, answer questions. Um, I, don't know. There are, I think they're mapping guild names. Oh. I'm trying to find a bit, like what is out there that they don't even know about. All right, that makes it a little. Not that I know. <laughs> 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 Never played one. Come in. 
Um, okay. So let's see, what else? What's Open There's, Table, by the way? What's what? What's Open Table? Open Table. Oh, it's uh, online reservations for restaurants. Okay. There's also Google Calendar. Oh, here you go. Yeah, Google Calendar. Google Calendar is cool. Uh, There's 30 boxes have an API, too. I don't know. But I mean, you can, you can do something, you can do it with either one. Yeah. Um, and there's, they do. They do? Oh. What I'm wondering is, in your, when you're doing a mashup with like Google Calendar, is it needing to log into your calendar account, or is it just? Oh, uh, so. Or is it looking at a public calendar? So you can, there's, there's a couple different ways. Google Calendar, you can either um, have like, you can get your own private like uh, URL for your RSS feed out of it. Or you can have also mark. You can have a, you have a public. You can have a public one where you, the things that you mark as public are published to that one, and then like private ones go to this other one that has a you know, big hash key on the end of it. So they now do have a uh, an XML feed. They always have. For a while, or I think when they first started, they didn't have that. Uh, I, I think they did because yeah, yeah. Cool. for sure. You can't just yeah. your own calendar, unfortunately. Yes, everybody's been bitching about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, it's you a real. You can, you can create events on an existing calendar under an existing one. Oh, you just have to create another a Gmail account or whatever? Yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> uh, like you don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to be a good like creating Google accounts. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know what? I'm trying to bring you back to that. I'm sorry, Google. Is there a way to, to do this? Um, you you want to go buy something from a grocery store, but you don't know which grocery store closest to you has that. Uh, it's not available online because uh, Safeway and QFC don't publish their feeds uh, as yeah. to which ones have it, but you want to know closest place I can go to in my area. Yeah, eggs, milk, whatever. And it's like, I get this item from this you kind can of You can probably store. prefer to specific brand I'm looking item. for availability also. Is it available? Sure. Is it, we, is it I feel like you could probably do it. And Since it's all private, I feel like you could probably do it to a probability. Like I know a Wujimana usually has this this kind of thing. But could you could you merge it with M Turk in a way that um, you have employees in each of these major things that get in a uh, that says, Hey, no, someone looking for this. Right. That's actually the cost of the SMS would be so much. Well, no, you can never use that for that. That stuff, it's, it's not that it's not available. It's, I mean, stores aren't going to make that stuff available. No. But if you had people, if you had a man on the inside, exactly. no, all you need is a guy like going around. You got a man on the inside. How about this? Is there a database which has the universal product codes about everything? So if you did that, most. On most states, what you, you might have to do a reverse engineering on most websites, and if you go screen scrape at worst, oh. usually our hash, I think our the hash or the hash of the UPC with usually store add-on, or sometimes just the straight UCP, you can, with a lot of willing stores, just go through their thing and grab it that way. So you're expecting people to send up the stores, dude. They're constantly keeping up the date with their key cards or whatever. And you're just constantly inventorying the stores constantly. You couldn't keep up with the Because different neighborhoods would change the price. Like Safe Safe Point here and say, a lot of stores say I have it available now. Best Buy. It's in store, so you can go pull that down from there and just go boom. The thing is to go to the stores that actually have the online inventory. What in stores that don't, that it's so they can make it available. Make sure you're directing towards them. Or if they can't make it available, they, 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 can, they have to have people there because if they don't respond, it's safe to respond, then people will safe to get it wrong. Yeah, make it into a competitive disadvantage. Make it, make it to their benefit. What about, what about something that just takes the actual mailing of the flyer and scans that neighborhood, air, geographic region, <laughs> scans it and compares what the ads are for that week for the all six grocery stores. Most, most people copyright their store ads in the grocery store business. But if you, no listen, listen, you scan it, throw it to Mechanical Turk, and then that person puts the things into just text. They can't, co can they copyright their actual? That's getting real sticky. Now see, see like, I work with newspapers, so they, okay. a lot of people they don't have like their full ads, they think the grocery the stores are fanatically bad, so we need about that, it. But the fact that a store has an item on sale, that is a fact, yeah. it's not something you can copyright. You have to like, yeah, there's gas like on certain items, items, there's laws that you have to prove <laughs> that you physically verified it. Because of some whole things, those gas station things. I don't remember the whole thing. I can talk to an editor, I know why. 
a small store value. So legally, I cannot say that such and such a store has such and such a product. Unless you verify it. It's why the gas symbol thing, they need to go through the seven disclaimers. Because it's not a newspaper, it's a web page. You say disclaimer. This is according possible to according to an interpretation of some, you know, and then technically everything is. I agree with you, Sarah. You just want someone who is a smart lawyer to say, yeah, you're covered or not covered. You want gas buddy? Or basically, store. yeah, yeah. But, but what's gas what's, buddy got to be? Is they don't. You can't call a gas station. Gas station. What's your price? They legally cannot tell you the price over the phone. They are violating federal law if they do. That I know for a fact. Um, Plus, if you're calling, calling a gas station, you're mentally. Well, I'm just saying, because people, <laughs> people get it, but, but, you know, that's how gas money got around. They, 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 if anyone was on their list in the beginning when they first started, they said they were, found out they were calling, they dropped their, dropped them off their list so they would void that law. Mm. Something from 1970s laws. I, I just want to, if you, if you the, take the time that someone spends in the, in the ads and you just cut it down to, they could just go to a, a Craigslist style page and just, visually scanned. Yeah. So what do you what do you so so yeah. 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 will not give you any listings. commercial. What about using Yeah, but the there's somebody that's I don't think they Math Craigslist and Google. They listed it. They don't know I've seen that mashup. People have that shut down. You can you can RSS. And Who was the coming my Oh, that's what it was. What about a Craigslist with you take car off of eBay or Craigslist and have somebody from the Facebook car drive it down the back to where you want? <laughs> That's actually, you could actually do really well with that. Yeah, that would be a good yeah. so yeah. you, you uh, Do what? A used Fine. car off of eBay or Craigslist yeah. and use Facebook car pool to drive it. Because there's services which you can yeah, find out yeah, for to drive cars across the nation for people. Just don't eat them and stuff like that. You're trying to dream it. So, yeah. That's uh, cool. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, Google Maps. Like, you could do trips like that, too. Yeah. And all in the place. I don't want to be able to say college students is driving cars. Over there and drive that. It didn't look like that in the picture. They have. Sometimes, like, seeing retired people will do that. will drive. It's better to say you get delivered to speed in a car. Anything. I'm sure you can expect to deal with an insurance company. Yeah. 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 <laughs> that would be cool, like just a grease monkey script, yeah. just for any old site, they, any e-commerce they can yeah. yeah. product, yeah. and they would yeah. plop something out. Yeah. You can do funny stuff like uh, using mTurk, find me. Okay, can we quit talking about mTurk? <laughs> 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 I'm raising my hand. Yeah, because that wouldn't require paying people for something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. and I'm anti yeah. not free stuff. Okay, not <laughs> mTurk. Uh, do a history of dig of uh, showing on Google Calendar what was popular at a particular day. Huh. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Because mm -hmm. I have friends yeah, who are like, oh, I just saw this video last week, and they can't find it on dig, right? That's because dude, that totally would never have got done today. <laughs> 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 so man, <laughs> 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 a year ago, dig was huge. Yeah, yeah. 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 dig losers, users for losers. Tomorrow is dig history. Yeah, exactly. Or the title. not star dupes in the star historical data. Dabble BB? Yeah. That's true. Uh, yeah, they are paid. They're paid. Oh, they are? Oh, they're, cool. they're, they're not free. Not. Are there any other, um, well, I guess like there's, there's Hoghead, the but they, they just went freebase. Freebase free is full of celebrities and. Uh, it sounds like the way to do drugs. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's totally not what they were going after. Sports teams and all that good stuff. It's a free base. We just need to normalize with you. Okay. I'm trying to think there's a, just looking at, I was just looking at some venture capitalists. They had uh, one of the things on their 
website was like a dabble DB type thing. But they had some, you could create an account for free, and then they create, you could create some simple free apps. But it's, I don't think there was a limit on data. It was just on the complexity of the app. Was that the, was that Coghead? Yes. Okay. Good job. Could make for that password. I never yeah, I could figure it out. Oh, really? I was what is that? Yeah. Coghead? Coghead, it's like that. Was, you're building apps. Yeah. Okay. yeah. But they just came out of beta, so it's like, they're Crap. starting to charge it. It's like, okay, you know that app that you built that you're using? Yeah. You want well, we're, we're, we're switching from the beta now, so just, you know, we, we warned you ahead of time. Google needs to buy Double DB and Alfred. Free. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, <laughs> well, what, but what does Freebase do? It's, it's a Wikipedia, but normalized like a database. So oh. when, you, when you're looking at an entry of a person, it knows that they're a person, and then you can uh, pivot on that to see what companies they work for, how many employees that company has, can what city. Do it? Was, yeah. You can import databases too. And it's a lightweight, the engine search are lightweight, it's not standard SQL, they did their own thing to make it really lightweight and fast for the type of things you're doing. It's pretty cool. Is it still in my? Yeah, yeah, I have two invites. People put in a name up oh. on the board. Oh, if you want to invite to that, other people yeah. probably have other. I probably have more. Yeah. 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 If you want to invite to this, like any sort of coordination, you can just email me. Invite trading stuff is kind of like gigantic. Oh, yeah. Like you trade an invitation from Pop Flies for sure. an invitation on Freebase. That's actually kind of like a share. Points, and, and, and like that. What? There's something like point trading. It's not a point. And then you'll get you'll get into the queue. So, 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 and there's those notoriously like restaurant flipping like places that are like yeah. constantly yeah. always changing restaurants. Does, 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 does the Google search timeline do that? I have no idea. It's like the, the, the way back machine for restaurants. Oh, the trend. Because you know, people like that. We were talking Yeah. What was the name of the restaurant that we used to go to? And they live somewhere you can look at what's been in your That's big. Yeah. They stopped their searching. I was going to be on Google Maps where you could just click on a point on the street and it would tell you the address. Approximate Google Maps. Yeah. Oh, fine. <laughs> oh, I didn't think that. Oh, really? Yeah, I just noticed that today. Oh, here. finally! <laughs> I was like, I want to go to Spokane, but I want to go Highway. I do it now. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, so data with Google, Google Maps. Oh, where you can search data. Where, 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 where you can eat while you're waiting for the grocery <laughs> 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 uh, uh, yeah. Sorry, no, I lived up this weekend. I'm like, so, uh, just you in general with calendars, it's like, oh, well, you're going to approach this area around noon. So, what are the uh, um, restaurants that share it? Road I mean, I go to Google Maps now. If you could, you could say it, but then say, it, but I don't want to go through this point. I bet you could figure out some, you make it, figure out some way around it. The California puts the road construction data out in RSS now. Oh really? I know lots. Cal Trans like a couple of yeah. So you'd say. Well, you I know, I know you can get it off the WS.web website. I don't yeah. Know if it's publishable. What if it matched uh, traffic patterns by the time of day? Well, um, doesn't. Historical best time to leave and yeah. not smart go to Smart flow for you your cell phone will make that. It does. It has predictive traffic analysis. Um, mm -hmm. You can build an app that says, at this particular time of the day, it's better for me to take the bus versus to take the car. I don't. Where do you get traffic data? Um, the the office has it. Yeah. Yeah, from your iPhone. <laughs> 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 could you? Could you? Get out of your iPhone. Could now. you build a mashup with like, I don't know, is, is Freebase something you could like start putting data into? Yeah. yeah so if you could like start loading like history of road construction, not road construction, but a history of traffic to predict yourself when traffic flows change and what the just come up with like points along a road and then like along like the somebody people can input the, the wait average wait time. 
No, no they no, don't do it. Talking about putting it in and then doing your own analysis. Yeah. Without them on it. Do what you're saying is that it's stuff. already been done by a company. Do analysis on it. Yeah. Don't because then they don't they put out real time analysis. Okay. Start just kind of collecting that. And that's that's. <laughs> that's. Yeah. When we say analysis, that sounds highfalutin again. Yeah. yeah. I like that. that you are talking about mashing up. Well, that construction with construction is great. Well, not construction. I'm just talking about traffic. Well, right, but construction and projects influence the traffic patterns. It's just in construction is finite. It kind of would. Well, yeah, it's easier to collect as well. There's no analysis involved. I know there's a, a Dodge. It's a database of every construction project based in the U.S. I don't think it's open and available, but. Wow. Um, I just have some friends in the construction business. I know that one. We can make the motorcycle community happy. Yeah. No, no, seriously, because if a motorcyclist, I once drove a 20 mile road going 12, two miles an hour and 12 miles is when you balance, which was all dirt road and I didn't know they were doing the construction in Montana until it was too late that I had to go there. I would have rerouted into a heartbeat to yeah. avoid having to Gro do that. Grooved pavement on a motorcycle is like hell. Yeah. It feels yeah. like you're going to die yeah, the whole yeah. time. <laughs> also, there's a little more like when they patch cracks yeah. in the, the target <laughs> on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Slither. <laughs> Can, can you get music information? So Rhapsody gets you music information based on artists and stuff like that? Uh, no, it plays music for you. You can. There's there's metadata. Metadata. Yeah. 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 And the other thing, if you're doing a cross country drive, um, maybe it pulls metadata based on where you are and plays it music. Plays local bands. Area. Dude, what about Ooh, what about bad. like a Google yeah. Map Last yeah. FM? Yeah. Right. So like when I hear that song, I think about Montana because I remember. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, people would dig that. Geotag music. Actually, I just got a little flashback. Okay, you don't have my voice. No, but you know, when you drive into a new place, it's like, well, what's the NPR station or the classic rock station? Where I'm at now, it's like, well, what's the NPR station? 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 So this is the GMAPs and radio station sounds cool because you can say, I'm driving from Seattle to Spokane, oh, and then yeah. it gives you, like, you get at a, at a certain point, you'd be like, what are the radio stations here? I mean, yeah. one, and I want to listen to, PBS, to NPR the whole time. Yeah. And, but they might be Why would you want to listen to NPR? Yeah, because commercial radio, imagine into your last yeah. event. Yeah. We have a hero. You've been listening to and what radio stations are of that genre. Yes, I like that. Yeah. <laughs> what? You found a guy who has a rest-based traffic API. Wow. Yahoo traffic. traffic Yahoo's not on the board anywhere. Oh, yes, it is. Yes, it is. How does that work? Is it points or is it anything? Uh, making your own mashup on a web page. Let's see. Take two, two APIs, put them together. They call it pipes. Oh, no, no. Yeah. Have you ever seen it? There's a flat line and there's a meter on the map. It's tennis. I was like, basically, I take one Yeah, they go. It's like, yeah. Yeah. So which one? Which ones are we most interested in seeing? Let's, because we're. I mean, not, not everybody here is obviously going to be interested in developing all of these. I could develop enough. Just bring the coffee. We'll make it happen. That's the participation that makes this a bed great. <laughs> I ain't doing crap. Um, there's so. What's an APA? So there's these. I guess I'll put them in boxes too because I can have them. Well, it goes a lot long. I, mean, yeah. I was thinking of it just about that you know, big mafia. Yourself, I was thinking they like the play. You, once yeah. you yeah. get yeah. your yeah. big game yeah. going, yeah. You, you could communicate <laughs> separately, right? Google and then Google. you spend like a week Google. finding out who you want to assassinate yeah. for like a week. Yeah. Yeah. You find like top yeah. users. Yeah. Like, yeah. 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 And you get your kind of hit list going. And you spend the week just burying them. Boom! Boom! We, we, we've got There's an addendum. of humility, you know, like the people that are like, oh, smack them. We've got an addendum. Go yeah, on. Yeah, that takes a lot of people. You can use the same the name of 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 the that's what the last FM is. We can that way you can specify just one genre. Last FM is like a music. What the music? Uh, right. Music you just, listen. just. But I thought last FM is what you are. Well, what you're listening to, and then also you can get right music recommendations. I think. Awesome. So, so this is just um, in general. Pandora. It could be any of the music sites. Pandora. 
Now I'm afraid. Is there Pandora? I'm afraid you might have the radio station data. See, it'd be great if, if Pandora listened to you last FM. You know what I'm saying? Last FM over, and then like it just what learned what is, already. It's you didn't have to spend time on Pandora. Like you, like you telling you why, and then you print out the rubber you Yeah, so you can say at this point, you know, my own rubber you switch. What do you mean print out? How do you know in what the the spot. Computer in your what do you mean someone has a list of your last name? have a list of your last name. Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you have a list of your last name? Well, why do you um, so this one is like the Facebook, like upcoming Facebook. So who's going to a certain event? Who has tickets? One and then also like, how can I get a ride home for, out of it? But like if I'm going to Dave Matthews Band, I'm going to get real drunk out of the gorge. I'm going to get home. How many little dots do we have each to, to put? <laughs> just vote for the ones. Just vote for the two that you think are the coolest. There you go. That's one I want. You two. How many dots? I got two. You have one. <laughs> and he doesn't know what API is, he gets <laughs> But he knows what coffee is, so he gets me use. Okay. Yeah, well, let's raise our hands. So, um, this one is, I don't know if we can really vote on this one, because that's... No, it's not really. It's, okay. it's paid. It's already paid. Okay, got it. So let's exchange, we'll, we'll just change information later yeah. for our mom. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I want to do that one. Because that's what, one well, one yeah. it's not really a, yeah. it's not really a, um, a mashup, but I was thinking like a Facebook private group where you like could create that mafia. See, uh, uh, why, why make it private? Just make a Twitter account that's like Seattle no. Day Mafia. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> that would be fun. Believe you. So this one is uh, how to get home, like how to get to and from concerts. Who's going? Of your friends. Uh, this one's actually I think this one actually has some pretty good value. It's actually not getting into business. This one's yeah, cool. You know, <laughs> Facebook, you know Facebook already has like the one like you can see which the ones of your friends are going. Yeah, but that's like so a Facebook event. But it's not. Yeah. You can also do like event data out of that as well. What? Use use event data for that as well. Yeah. Oh yeah. Facebook, Facebook event data. Event well, data. Yeah, yeah, like like calendars like from newspapers or you know things. Oh like yeah, yeah. Like, you know, calendar. What's this going on? Yeah. So this is this is. I mean, upcoming has a lot of that stuff. Right oh, okay. Here. You don't. It's not just that stuff. And this, yeah. So we're gonna, and then, okay. So the housing one is the uh, oh, yeah. house swap and organizing it with flight times and. Yeah. Um, I think that's like, a good one. I, I, I think that's. Oh, we're we're gonna we're reviewing. Oh, okay. We're reviewing. Oh, sorry, I should have made that more uh, clear. More we're reviewing. <laughs> um, this one is okay. So this one is road construction <laughs> plus Google Maps and traffic because we can get traffic, so it's, I guess it's telling you where to not go. Um, uh, dig guys, uh, history of history of things that have been dug, popularity. Um, and then the G maps the radio station mixed with black, some music recommendation. Uh, even, uh, this one's cool too. Facebook, the Facebook carpool organizer for moving cars across after you buy on eBay. I like that one. Okay, so top two, you vote for your top two. Oh yeah, we can flicker. We can. Oh yeah, the, the, the first one is the flicker up. I mean. Oh, this one. Oh, plus. Yep. Mm. Oh yeah. The, oh yeah, yeah. There was mm. flick the, back. The, the, the whole the past past yeah. Before we started. I thought that was linked in with that other one. Maybe it is. So, you know, like, you know, <coughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Let's make link. Yeah. Plus flicker. Oops. Um. Who's going and who went? Um. Plus pictures. Okay. So. So for here, how many got for this one? We're voting on two, right? Yeah, you get to vote on two. So we got what's that one? Upcoming Facebook with pictures. Like who's going? Like who's going to a concert? What did the last one look like? And carpools. What's Facebook? You basically <laughs> 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 something. Hi, it's not close to Facebook. Something. It's like social networking around concerts and. Oh, well, I mean, it's more than just concerts. And socializing to some extent. How many? Oh yeah, so for this, okay, for, yeah, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then the housing one, 
I skipped one. Hey, we're, not, <laughs> we're not doing the cry. We're, we're not doing the cry one publicly. That's, yeah, yeah. That we're not right. doing this one. We're not. Recording. <laughs> <laughs> we're not a tape for talk. So there's a housing. So keep your hands up for the housing one. Yeah. Housing. I'll swap. Or I'll swap with the two phone. Three, four, five. So five. No, there's more. They weren't, paying attention. they weren't paying attention to that coin. <laughs> Did anyone intend to vote for the housing thing in the flight times and didn't raise their oh, hands? Like oh, see? Come on. <laughs> Six. 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 Holy shit. Okay, so eBay motors, carpool. I would go vote for that vote. Oh, you're going to, you guys double vote? You're going to shotgun vote? You're... Okay. Oh, you can vote. No, you can't do that. Why not? Because I'm making the rules. Yeah. One, two, three, he has the marker too. Okay. Are you, are you the vice president? Yeah. You're your own special oh. fantasy government. It's your own little thing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I live in my own world. Okay. Yeah, um, Turks are coming. So then, how's about uh, the G maps and the radio stations? Um, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I've already found databases for that that uh, have basically um, GPS locations of transmitters for every radio station. And their power? And not, I don't probably their power. And their genre. Have their power. And um, um, okay. frequency call us. <laughs> um, <laughs> what about uh, Dig Guys? <laughs> So we had one, two, three, four, five. Um, I'm over digging, so there's too much news. <laughs> um, and then the road constructions and maps and traffic. We all used up our roads. Yeah. I'm voting for that. So, I mean, these ones are pretty similar. Uh, I mean, pretty similar <laughs> votes, so. Top one every day. Uh, in Drumshire, Google, I see GMAS. Yeah. I'm going to post them. Um, all right, so I'm going to do it. When you're bringing your car across the town. Like so who are going to post something else now? Who are for one of these two? Oh, no, I mean, we can do both. We can do both. Let me know. Let's get our own. That would be on there. All right. And that's it.